I wouldn't go out there and play unless I felt like I could help the team. So I, I'm, I don't think when I go out there it, it hurts, but I don't think I'm at a weakened state where I'm vulnerable to getting beat more so than other times I think it's obviously painful at some times, but um, it's still fun to be out there and, and play with play with the team and play with your brothers and um, go out there and battle. And obviously we're, we're having some, some really good results right now as a team. Uh, so that's something you want to be a part of. You want to be a part of turning this, this team and this organization around. And, uh, you know, that's why you keep playing. You know, we strung a few good weeks together before this past week, and I was feeling pretty good going into the last game. Uh, then, you know, sometimes it gets re-rolled up on and you kind of have to start the process back over again. Sunday. Yeah, so it's, you know, we've been through it. It's happened a few times. Uh, Pittsburgh last week, a few times, Cincinnati, a few times we've been rolled up. Um, but we'll start the process over again and, and go through it. You barely made it to the sideline at one point in the third quarter. Did you worry that that was it and you weren't going to get back out there? Or? Uh, yeah, that was probably the worst one of the year. Um, where it took, took a while in the tent just wrapping it up and kind of getting my bearings back. Um, but I kind of got into every game so far just with the idea that I wasn't going to miss a play. Um, and when that's no longer an option, then, then you just find a way to go back out there. So um, that's kind of how I've gone into every, every game this year is just I'm not, I'm not going to miss a play. The message to Joe that he should, his streak is in danger? <laughs> oh, I, don't th I wouldn't say Joe's streak's in danger. Uh, that, that's far from it. From other people other than me. But... Uh, but no, I think Joe's Joe. You can leave that number up in the rafters for a while. I don't think anybody's going to reach it. Chris Hubbard has talked about how he's made changes and improved through the year. How have you seen him get better?